It's time to jump into episode 17 of Cowboy Bebop titled Mushroom Samba. We're dealing with mushrooms this time, which, uh, I mean, usually when we deal with mushrooms in any type of media, it usually leads into psychedelic stuff. That's my only assumption from going into this, and let's see what happens. Because the last time we dealt with Jet's past, however, I don't think we're going to be dealing with anyone's past this episode from the title of the episode. However, maybe if it is dealing with psychedelics... <laughs> they will deal with some type of past and some type of vision they see. So let's jump into episode 16 of Cowboy Bebop, my reaction and discussion. Welcome to Nonstop Antonio, where I talk about everything nerdy. I love Marvel, DC, and anime, and if you do too, I hope you enjoy this video. All I'm asking is who ate the food that was in this <laughs> Oh, words. oh of course, on. someone ate the food. It's probably, it's either Faye or Ed calling her right now. Maybe you ate it and you're just pretending to be mad because we found the body. What's that? <laughs> we haven't had How are you guys always starving? That's what I want to know. How do they always it's never have food? Longer, like, they never have anything to eat. Mouthing off like that and I'll toss you out into absolute zero. At this point, <laughs> even I looks good enough to eat. Watch it. Whoa. I bet you're looking pretty good to him, too. <laughs> <laughs> and has like a tiny piece of food. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I can just eat it. <laughs> oh my god. I swear to god, these guys get themselves in a pickle every time. Ooh. Ooh, this ship is just destroying theirs. And it's leaving them. It's a hit and run. It's a hit and run. Hit and run. <laughs> oh my god. Western world development and they crash land onto a planet It sounds like if they crash landed they die just a little bit just a tiny weeny bit What a start to an episode they land on a desert looking planet with no food no fuel and now a broken ass ship Damn they're gonna have to do some stuff to get uh, by at this point because who knows what's gonna happen now if You could hunt up a little food bay <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? Pain. Oh. It's a joke. <laughs> as soon as they land, I got a pain. I can't help. Uh, these rations expired a year ago. Oh, looks like we know who ate them. <laughs> oh, we all knew it was Faye right off the bat. Like, I don't think anyone knew it wasn't Faye. I kind of figured it was going to be her. She tends to eat all the food. She was eating dog food the first time we met her. I love that as a character. She's hilarious. She's so weird. Oh, my. she's like, I'm going to wear socks to go outside. Has her shoes ready. Just starts walking out with bare feet. Oh, my God. Her and I are going on a trip. <laughs> what are you doing? Just going for a roll. Oh, is that the ship that hit him and ran? Oh, it, I, wow. It was. <laughs> so it looks like maybe there was... um. A possible, like, what's the term I'm trying to think of? Uh, settlement here at one point. Or there still is. This could just be the desert between towns. Oh, maybe there, yeah, never mind, because there's watermelons. Don't bother with the chain. But if you see this man, give me a call. I'll show my Oh, is she a bounty hunter or is she just looking for this dude? Okay, so there is a town here and there is a proper settlement and all that stuff. Okay, interesting. Okay. So the way they made it sound, it looked like the way they made it look like is that when they crash landed, this was just like an empty planet. But there is, there is like actual stuff here. It also just looks like Earth. So very interesting. It's like the oh, maybe it's more like the Wild Wild West. A mushroom dealer. Ooh, was I right about the psychedelics? What a coincidence. Okay. Big bounty. Oh, she is a bounty hunter. I and uh, Ed are in the back. Huh? What? Huh? All right. <laughs> hey. <laughs> they all think he kidnapped Edward and Ed and I just climbed in the back. <laughs> oh my god. So curious to see if... Did anyone not see um, the people crash land? Oh look, it's a bounty! Oh my god. I'm putting you inside of it. Gets run over. Happy way to die, huh? Wait. 
<laughs> makes a run for it, but drops a bunch of mushrooms. Oh, I just ate. Oh. Oh, oh, Ein's tripping balls. Oh, God. Someone gave the dog magic mushrooms. That's not going to end well. Ed, do not eat that. Ed, do not eat that. Ed. So they crash landed on a planet that has people. Is no one going to see their crash ship? Like, at all? Really? Faye's just going to eat it. She just sees the mushroom, doesn't even questions it, and eats it. <laughs> Ed put it out just to test what happens when they eat it. Oh, my God. <laughs> At least Ed didn't eat it. She's just letting everyone experiment and eat it. You know, if I saw if I saw a mushroom sitting on the table, uh, I probably wouldn't eat it because of the amount of times, you know, you could accidentally eat a magic mushroom or something that's bad for you or poisonous. Like, it doesn't look like your regular mushroom. It looks like something you'd find on a forest floor. And I don't know if I'd want to eat that. With Spike, it didn't even look like he took it. He just kind of snuck up and it, it like, it, he was so smooth there. Oh, they're all going to be tripping out now. It's a psychedelic episode. So it's looking like every time they hiccup, it's what puts them in the, the state. Honestly, I did not expect this at all from this episode. When I saw that said mushroom, I kind of figured it was going to be something psychedelic. Because why would you put mushroom in that title otherwise? But still, we've seen some interesting stuff. But this is an all new, like, weird. Weird. The world really is a great place. <laughs> <laughs> Jet's just talking to his bonsai trees. Oh, wow. Did I just say something? <laughs> Oh, uh, you know that, don't you? Obnoxious little frog. <laughs> Spike's just walking up the never-ending stairs. He's not even walking up the stairs. He's just <laughs> okay. So Ein ate one, and Ein was tripping out for that moment. But now Ed's just kind of watching everyone as they trip out while they do whatever. <laughs> oh, Faye's in the washroom. I want to see why Ed's gotta be watching her. I want to see what is going on. She just stand there. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> hey at least they get to forget that they're starving right <laughs> oh it's bounty time <laughs> so everyone is tripping out and now it's ein and it's now it's ein and freaking <laughs> and ed's time to shine oh both of them are gonna get the bounty and eat some food Okay, this is gonna be great. We got Ed and I. We got Ed finally doing something after multiple episodes. I've been waiting so long. I like at one point I'm like, oh, this is a wild, wild west. And then just as we progress through this, it's like a normal town with normal cars. Like I, it was giving me wild west vibes because of the like the the desert. And now it not at all. We're like in a normal town, like a small town, with like nice cars and just people coming from all over. I like how they're like, so you you didn't you didn't get the kid. Why is the kid there? Oh my god, the three guys. These guys are traveling. They're randomly in so many different episodes, just kind of hanging out in the town, station, wherever everyone else is. <laughs> oh, these guys get around. They get around for sure. They're everywhere. Anyways, like I was saying, I don't understand why the cop would arrest them, uh, arrest the chick for having Ayn and Ed in the back of his car, or her car, because like, they... they <laughs> Like she just they just left the kid go. They didn't even ask the kid anything. They just let the kid wander off and didn't do anything about it. Oh, mushroom mushroom dude is the hidden runner. <laughs> Did she say, she say stinky gas? Is that what she said? <laughs> oh my god. I just, I just, I can't with, oh my god, I can't with Ed running, it's so funny, she's just like flailing her arms as she runs. <laughs> I think this is the, I think this is the most fun I've had with an episode, yeah, it's just Ayn and Ed's little adventure. Oh my god. Send Ein the smart dog to save the day. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. All caused by a kitten or a dog. Absolute mayhem. There's a cow on the train. There's a cow on the train tracks. <laughs> 
Wow, that's the fastest train I've ever seen stop. Otherwise, that cow would have been obliterated. I, oh my god, Ed. It just doesn't even... Wait, there's, the animals are talking? What the hell? Oh my god. Ed doesn't even take the take the guy in. She just takes the 100k worth of mushrooms. Everyone's waking up. What? Why does your face look like that? Did you put lipstick on? Oh my god, Jet. <laughs> Ed's just gonna give them up. He just got him 100k worth of mushrooms. And now she's gonna give up the 100k worth of mushrooms. Is Spike still tripping? All clear. Nope, they're just regular mushrooms. Ed got ripped off. Ed gave up a bounty for nothing. Shiitake stir fry. Shiitake stew. <laughs> now all they have is mushrooms to eat. Oh my god. That was a fun episode. Oh, 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 oh. Oh no, there's still a little mushroom in there. There's still some psychedelic ones in there because I, I ate one. Oh my god, that was... That was a fun episode. Let's talk about it. That episode overall was just really fun. Watching Ed and I just go on a really fun adventure while everyone else was tripping out on shrooms was great. And I just love how it's just another episode where they don't get the bounty. And it's all because Ed is such a clueless girl that she just gave up the bounty. She's like, oh, 100k worth of mushrooms? Okay, I'll take it. Why not? And leaves the bounty. And I love how she just fumbles everything on the way, but they all look hilarious. Like when she's just flailing her arms as she runs. And I on the backpack is just, oh my god, that was hilarious. I I, I think it's the episode where I've had the most enjoyable time watching it. Just like funny, and it's just weird, and I really liked it. I'm still really hoping we get to learn more about Ed's past and where she came from, but I'm sure that's to come. I thought everyone was going to be doing a little bit more during this, like while they were tripping, like they were like going on a little adventure themselves, but that's okay. It was still really fun. What did you think of this episode of Cowboy Bebop? Did you laugh your ass off like I did? If you liked my anime reactions, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, helps out the channel a lot. And if you want to see my other anime reactions, check the description down below for where they're listed. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later.